Okay, now let's check in with Dennis Valera in Westminster with how things are looking there this noon. Carroll County Public Schools, by the way, one of several districts that closed today. Dennis. Hey, Denise, you can see behind me the sidewalk is pretty much clear. You can see the snow has been uh, pushed to people's yards, pushed to the side. So people got up early to get this all done. Also, this car right next to me, you can see some snow on the windshield. Now, the storm, it made people blow the dust off of their shovels because we've had a string of some warm days before all this happened. Now, we're going to show you some video from Tawny Town clearing walkways, steps. It wasn't as bad as what we got a few weeks ago, but but still enough to leave a mess. Plows were out also to help clear the roads. This wet, sticky snow, though, there's still a lot of slush left on the road. People WJZ talked to say overall, very manageable to deal with, but some are just ready for that warmer weather, wanting spring to get here a little faster. It's very heavy, it's wet, it's sticky, but it seems to be uh, drivable because everyone seems to be moving, so. It works out. It works out all right with me. I like it. It's beautiful. I go from like 60 degree weather to this. Come on. It wasn't as bad as I thought it would be, but still, yeah. it's just be spring. Yeah. Everyone's spring. <laughs> Denise, you mentioned Carroll County Schools is closed. It's just one of a number of school districts that are closed because of the weather. We have a full list of all closures and delays up on our website, wjz.com.